Well, in the most embarrassing moment, just happened, <laughs> you guys. Shit! Jeez, I did. Yep. I didn't think the most embarrassing moment would happen during this podcast. My goodness. Jeez. It's <laughs> like, no, ask me the most embarrassing moment. I guess the most embarrassing moment should have gone wide. But that's right. It. So. Going dark. Okay. All right. That's not Lay it on the us. most Lay embarrassing on moment. Okay. When technology works, that's pretty embarrassing. But last night I had a little too much fun with a glass of wine, oh. and oh. yeah, it didn't end. It didn't end, but <laughs> I basically landed on the floor. I yeah, yeah. So that's my most embarrassing moment, and I will um, I will be more careful on Friday. That's why I'm actually taking Friday off. So that I can recover, <laughs> because look, you only done thirty once, but technology going down is pretty embarrassing, right. you guys. And having too much fun with a glass of wine is also embarrassing. Hell, I already gave you a free pass with Friday. You were hemming and on about it last week about, well, oh, just in case I, you know, I don't know what I'll do on Friday. I was like. Yeah. No. Why, no. Why don't you just do us all a favor and take the day off? <laughs> okay. Because I don't want I don't yes. want to text in the morning or late at night. Yes. And my phone next to my no. ear saying, oh, no. I can't do it tomorrow morning. So like, so I told you. Well, why bother coming to work the next day? You only turned turn 31. <laughs> yes. oh, you're killing me. Yes. You're so funny. Yes. Oh, this my is God. my job. <laughs> Quite the frankly. That's right. This is my job. So, yes. See, I thought about that. I thought about that this morning. Good thing I'm taking the fight day off. I'm like, yeah, uh, yeah. After the last night, I'm like, all right. I think I declared fight day off. That kind of leads. That, you're right. That kind of leads me to my last question of the day for you, my friend. Since it's your birthday, and it doesn't have to be your birthday, what does a perfect day look like to you? On my thirtieth birthday, and don't be writing on my Facebook wall, you guys, because you guys won't get a response. I don't have it on my phone because it's a battery killer. But um, the perfect birthday will consist of family and friends who really know me and love me and taking me out to lunch and then um, hanging out with family nice. and friends. So that's going to be what Thursday's going to consist of. Now, you guys, I know this has been a wonky week, and you're going to have to hang with me. And we'll all be back next week. And so that's that. Well, I'll tell you what. You, you deserve the best of birthdays. We love you, and thank you for being who you are. You're an amazing person. I am grateful that the universe put us together uh, to collaborate. And like I said earlier, you have definitely made me a better professional and a better person. I thank you for that, my dear. I love you very much. I wish you had the grandest of birthdays. And when you come out to Northern California, since you love Vino so much, we're going to Napa. Yes. I am taking you to Napa. <laughs> yes. We're going to go wine tasting. And we're not going to care how many glasses of wine we drink, and we're going to laugh and be merry and have a great time. How about it? Yes. Yes. Well, Absolutely. That's, um, that's the plan. And tomorrow, you guys, um, actually, you guys get an episode on Wednesday, interesting episode on Wednesday. Tomorrow, you guys, you get another episode where you get to see Mel play coach live because we're doing oh, guys live nice. so you guys can hear. Yeah. Right. Mel knows exactly what it is. That's why he's staying on us. And so hopefully mm-hmm. he'll get more business to refuse off of this. And hopefully I will get the answers I need from you guys because, as you know, I've been 
in going, pursuing the creative field for the past four years now. It, it was four years to the feast that we started this podcast. And my hope is by the time I'm 45, I will make it to the New York Sun special list, which all in all that would, I not like that accolade, but I know it would help my work and where my work is going. So, yeah, that is that. And, yeah, so on the Wednesday morning, you guys get to hear um, Mel go live, and then on Thursday, you guys get to hear this episode. I won't be around. I will be in hiding. I actually <laughs> have an uh, episode that I'm recording on Thursday that may go out on Monday just because I don't have time to put it up. I mean, I barely have time to think on Thursday. I barely have time to think today. So I don't know what um, Tuesday's going to bring. I know we're doing a live cooking call, but I um, I don't know what Tuesday's going to bring. So that's that, you guys. Well, nonetheless, it's going to be a brilliant show. Uh, we'll deep dive into some, some things. And, uh, you know, Wynn, thank you so much for being so candid today. And I'm pretty sure that your loving audience has a deeper appreciation for you now since you've let them inside your world for just a little bit and a little bit of a glimpse. So thank you for that. Have a, oh, an amazing you. birthday. Yeah, thank you for letting me do this. I feel honored. I know that a lot of people wanted to do this, and you gave me, you gave me a shot at it, and I hope, uh, I hope I served you well today. So. Thank you again. And, well, you uh, did. I'll let you take and it away. Thank you. We're, um, we're just going to do this every single year. So when you guys want to hit me up, we can set up the birthday episode anytime in June. Obviously, um, the day of it would be a little bit tough. But um, other than that, I'm free as a bird, and hopefully – um, after the deep dive small, hopefully that you guys will hear something that struck a chord with you and hopefully you can help Mel and I both out because we need it. We are independent podcasters and we need it. And I forgot to ask you Mel, how's your other podcast coming or is it not? It's still in the development stages. I'm working on a book right now, and I'm also part of an international coaching group right now out of the U.K., so taking taking my time with it. Um, but I have some concrete visions and ideas that I'm going to be implementing, and you better believe you are going to be one of my very first guests on the Fit Love Strong podcast really soon. So thank you for asking. Well, we want an update on that. And I'm going to let you go get back to your – Projects, but I thank you for taking the time out to interview me, and then we'll see what happens tomorrow. Sheer pleasure, my friend, and we'll hit it again tomorrow. I can't wait. Okay? Thank you. Bye. Thank you.